Lady, lady, you're in the wrong place. I have an appointment. Arthur. Good morning. Ah, Miss White. Have a seat. Well, what did he say? Well, Detective Fraser turned out to be quite sharp, but I just fast-tracked his career a little, and he's under control. I hope so. Tell me about the envelope. Where is it now? Well, the gang leader is going to hang on to it as an insurance policy to keep you from seeking revenge. Clearly, he has a, a very low opinion of you. And what might that be? Well, let's see, in a nutshell, um, that you got rich doing business with the Nazis during the Holocaust. Yes. It was 60 years ago. I was young and ambitious. I saw a short path to success, and I took it. I sold my soul. And I've been trying to buy it back ever since. But you and this uh, mystery man, you have an understanding? I think so. But he managed to get out of there with that envelope. His Sunday, he comes back to blackmail you. Well, you'll pay him and you'll get it back. So I guess that's it. I suppose so. Bullshit. I beg your pardon? He didn't go through all that just to stick your envelope under his mattress. Look, they left money untouched, Arthur. So? So. He had to have walked out of there with something else. The bank says that there was nothing missing. So there had to have been something in that box that was worth more to him than your envelope. You don't have to tell me. There's only one thing it could be, anyway. Diamonds. And then there's the ring. Katya ring. It belonged to the wife of a Parisian banker, wealthy family of French Jews. And when the war came along, the ring and everything else they owned was confiscated, and they were shipped off to concentration camps. None survived. We were friends. I could have helped them. But the Nazis paid too well. Ken, I trust that you will keep what you learned here today confidential, despite whatever you may think. Well, I'd love to tell you what a monster you are, but um, I have to help Bin Laden's nephew buy a co-op on Park Avenue. <laughs> hmm. uh, if that were true, you wouldn't tell me. We're listing you as a reference. Dalton 